Another game, another demon dice, huh? I do want to try out the new Mako. And I do see a spark of strength, which could be me having a little bit of fun. We'll see how things go, though. So what don't I want to deal with here? No Octavia, I can see. I'd rather no Kazan for spark, potentially. And in case there's an enemy Kazan, considering how in this same game in this recording session today where i did just go against the kazan earlier we'll see how things go though i might go vicious just there's a zentaro i'm definitely going vicious because we'll i am not going to deal with these two just even with a now on our team i don't trust myself to live long enough especially with the spark of strength on the field i'll just yeah i'll just take vicious and say please don't kill me today <laughs> The one time I don't bend Zentaro and I'm like, I'd rather not deal with the player on my team who kind of demolished everybody else otherwise. So it's Powerhouse Pogent's Mato Goli. Let's see, I quit that out of the bra browser again. This sucks. Alright, it's okay though. Good patience by, uh, uh good patience by, uh, Mr. Space right there. By Kai right there. I need to make my impact in the field in order. And also, this is going to be my first, um, now, uh, now? <laughs> Mako game ever. That was an early strike. That was bad. But I can keep Zentaro away. And I also, um, because I never really played Zentaro just because of the fact that I hate him, I wasn't keeping up with my empowered strike right there. So I should take note of that for the future. Because especially since I can just build up charges like so, I could potentially find ways to just cheese hits out of them. And cheat things like a miniature finial is what I was trying to do right there. Ooh, didn't get the hit. It's okay though. Just stand in front of the passing lane if I can. And keep things clear of Zen if possible. Green strike got got denied by uh, what's his face. Got denied by Zen standing in front of it, and I didn't have enough evade to uh what's his face. To dodge Vysol. But it's alright. Kai's burst gets it for us, and we are very happy with that. Yeah, I've already been brewing some ideas after seeing Goli now from my last game in this recording session. And with this be- uh, this is the second game ever I've played of Now Patch. So I'm really gonna be trying to figure things out on how I want to play as her and deal with enemies. Because especially with us playing against, uh, uh, against two hyper-offensive enemies. I feel like I could definitely try to leverage my core control with her here. That really sucks. Save my empowered strike to try to force past Vice, exactly so. And that's great work, everybody. It's great work. My thing got cancelled, which is so unfortunate. I'm also not finding a good... Uh, not finding uh, to space. Good use out of my secondary yet, but I think I should probably try to use it more for a teammate buff. And a stopgap, because going now from my last game, used it in anticipation to try to base or to, uh, to keep the core from getting past her instead of what's his face, instead of trying to use it as a direct core contest tool. So I think that's the adaptation I need to make. Deny the passing going to Zentaro. Keep it in the corner for us, and try to second strike it away is what I was hoping for right there. Ooh, now, now a sensory drone, the slowest hit ever. I was charging up my, my, um, I was about to say drum and bass, but that's my secondary, my primary strike right there, because I'm trying to serve as a strike shot so that if it goes upwards at all, if the core goes up, I just immediately keep it away from Vice. It could go to Zentaro, but in which case then I'm maybe going to try to hit it before he, before he can. Now, big things here. Kai gets another spark, which is going to be great for him. More agility is always going to be nice, especially against the hyper-offensive team comps that we're having to deal with. I think probably peak for me, just to make sure I survive, because Glass Cannon Zen, and to start Glass Cannon, I'm going to be taking way too many hits, so build to my win condition of Vicious Van Brace, especially since Reverb's back in. That's what I'm going to try to probably hope for. Now, I do have Empowered Strike, so I can just win the war. Let's lock Vice down if we can. I was trying to see if I could lock her down so we could make an offensive play otherwise. It's alright. 
just cover the top and keep it away from strikeable territory. Second strikes are great. I feel like quick strike could also go really hard. I'm trying to get this to Mal, but I'm not finding a good angle. Good patience, try. Yeah. Wait until Vice really moves out of position there. Good strike shot, basically. From other from going now. I'm going now. I keep trying wanting to say now because I'm just so used to her being the newest striker. But no, I'm playing as the newest striker, ladies and gentlemen. I also have burst, so don't be greedy. Just use. Straight down. Uh, Mata already moved up, so it's basically as long as I pu push Zen Taro out and hope that test of his reflexes, he doesn't immediately strike afterwards. I've got this. Perfect pitch is what it's called. Perfect pitch is what it's called in, in, in snare drums. Wow, actually, that's great music puns all, all around. And that's coming from me as a former drummer in my middle school and high school band classes. In snare drum. That's actually a brilliant pun and a half. Holy crap, dude. Ooh, a little too late, but I'll, pro I'll, I'll probably just get used to timing more in the future. Good dash then. Nice defense, Kai. Try striking immediately towards. Instead, do this to just keep Zentaro in. Because, yeah, I like, as, as long as he's staggered, he is basically just a striker dead in the water. Just thanks to, uh, what's his face? Just thanks to his glass cannon never being able to crotch. So we just get full control on him, and yeah, it just takes a good hit from now or, or Giga Blast from Kai to just end his career. The fact is, now can he, okay, the fact is, our, like, us, uh, us strikers, like, us forwards, have so much self peeling for ourselves that it's actually ridiculous. Now just heals past everything that the enemies try to do to her. Whereas I just have vicious and uh, uh, I have vicious and um, peak performance, so I just force my way past everything. Dude, that's a little awkward. I thought my enhanced strike would hit the core and Zen, and it just didn't work out. So it's whatever. Still, new new strikers on the field. You gotta figure them out. Good hit. Didn't get exactly what I wanted there. Ooh, I wanted I wanted to do my burst first, but other Mato beat me to it, but it's okay. Just keep whacking Zen quite literally. Keep denying his glass cannon at every opportunity that I can here. Ooh, that ate my hit. That's alright. Now he's got this. I shouldn't have hit it straight towards the enemy vice. That's a error on my end, but it's alright. And that's just a nice clean through ball of an angle. Good stuff, guys. Good stuff. So I was debating I could hit it to the mouth projectile, but I think with the size the Sentry Drone was at the moment, it was actually going to be small. It was actually going to be a weaker hit. So instead, it's just, alright, I'll just hit it myself. They don't want to stunt the speed, otherwise other Mako could catch up. Reverb could legitimately be the play for me here, because that gets me even more stagger. So I'm even much more of a non-factor when it comes to their kills. It stats my peak performance as well. And yeah, I'm kind of ridiculous right now, dude. Vice does get specialized training, which is unfortunate. I could have taken that away from her, but I'm voting to my win condition more than denying hers. Since I haven't been feeling, I haven't been fearing kills. Now, granted, it's specialized Vice. I've been abusing Vice so much this meta for a good reason when it comes to. Ah, uh, I need, I need to recognize that if I ever get hit, perfect pitch just gets canceled, and that can't be allowed to happen. Because I'm losing a whole ability when that happens. Both of us are looking at Zentara right now. This is funny. Oh, I missed my empowered strike. Just keep cutting the passing lane off if I can. Good kill. Trend up. Yep. Good hit. 
Just hearing the baseball noises is hilarious, dude. Good burst from me and better control. Oh, I didn't reach. Oh, yeah, that's that's kind of hard because there's no good way for me to clear right there. Because Vice just hits it before, uh, because Vice, uh, hyper, uh, Hypernova, Supernova hit it before I could strike it. That's all good. That's just, you know, sweet circumstance. Not every day a situation you're gonna expect. Good evasion to get away from my ult, especially so. I'm looking to hit Vice with this, potentially. I'm also falling back so I can cover for Kai since he's moving up with his burst. Oh, hello, Vice. <laughs> I did nothing but do it just be a bully to them. Yeah, problems with their offensive team comp is that they can't confirm their kills just because of our great and sustain or just amount of stagger that we have, which is super hilarious in my opinion. A little too high, but it's okay. Vice's burst angles have been quite horrible. I'm not going to lie, Chief. Do this to keep it on their core, because even even though Vice did have a good play right there of just holding Supernova to kill me, fact is I got the goal barrier, which is where I feel they really start falling apart. I don't think I've ever got struck out like that before. Charging this, trying to get in the way. I'm also trying to boost our now right now. Let's try. Well, stagger, stagger vice in that case. <laughs> I didn't get a chance to KO her. That's hilarious. That is still hilarious. And also, that did kind of stun her out of the way, so she can't intercept. Okay, I need, I need to find that there's good chances for me to really interrupt and destroy them. That is unfortunate. That's just me being stunned from both specials. It's alright though, it's alright. Now granted, I kept saying that yeah, freak deaths are really the only ways that we should be losing this, and I'm the one who's died twice now. So that's definitely on me. Nah, 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 nah. It's on me, boys. It's on me. We've had pretty good control. I just keep dying to Vice Old, and that's literally it. But I gave up to her. But otherwise, they have no other pressure. Just play, play the game solidly, and we're fine. Doing this to try to lock Vice out if I possibly hit her was the plan right there. Just keep whacking. Keep whacking them. The, the, the Empowered Strike is actually hilariously weak, but I also don't have too many like kill traits or anything like that to really help with it. Good. Just hit it out of the entire reach. Woo! <laughs> I'm playing baseball, baby! Let's go, boys! Good stuff, good stuff. Definitely my teammates were the real MVPs there, considering how both times that I died, we really started conceding goals. But I'm figuring out now, I do like her in the striker position, because I feel like she can actually have pretty good attrition, thanks to how it feels like her, like her cooldowns weren't too egregious, honestly. And yeah, her ultimate just feels like a better a better way of just saying, Hey, I Asher ulted you. Hey, I Mato ulted you. You die. <laughs> Props to now for tanking so much of the enemy aggression and destroying Zentaro's life whenever we got him staggered too. That was pretty good. Even though I did die to Vice a few times, fact is, if she doesn't have her ult or if she can't find a good angle for it, then, well, you, you saw right there, they really can't make a play off of the KOs. Because if your entire team comp can only make plays off of KOs, but that only happens once in a blue moon, it falls apart. But you can't blame them there. I mean, they were going against pretty oppressive. I mean, I had Vicious, and now it's this for crying out loud. So it's kind of hard for you to make your way in, unless you have really good burst.